Superfood Evolution presents Blackberries and their beneficial properties. Top reasons to eat them. The blackberry is an edible fruit that comes from the rose family Rosaceae, as their thorny vines and prickly green leaves might indicate. Blackberry plants belong to the genus Rubus, a varied assortment of flowering plants, the most widely dispersed of which include blackberries, raspberries, and dewberries. The edible fruit is, botanically speaking, not an actual berry, but is an aggregate species composed of a cluster of tiny round droplets, each which form the entire berry itself. The berries, usually a dark purple-black color with a reddish-purple juice, are produced from its white to pale pink blossoms. The pollinated flowers will develop berries that turn green, red, and then a ripe, plump, sweet, and juicy deep purple in the heat of late summer or fall season. We are especially familiar with the wild California blackberry, Rubus ursinus, which have naturalized throughout the Pacific Northwest and are particularly prolific in the Sierra Nevada foothills, often found growing in meadows and forested locations near wild grapevines. Wild blackberries are a food source of the black bear and other wildlife. The etymology of the term Rubus ursinus actually comes from Rubus, which means bramble, and ursinus, which comes from the word ursus, meaning bear. Adapting well to poor soils, the vines grow fast and vigorously and will eventually create dense thickets that can take over entire hillsides. Their arching woody vines, also called canes, often interweave forming what is commonly referred to as a bramble, or specifically a blackberry bramble. Blackberries like the Rubus or Maniacus, or the Himalayan blackberry, are sometimes considered an invasive species for this reason. There are over 375 species of blackberries, as well as many cultivars like the Loganberry, Marionberry, and Boysenberry. These varieties are hybrids derived from different combinations of several main Rubus parent species, such as Rubus alleganensis, referred to as common blackberry, and Rubus fruticosis, prevalent in Europe. Blackberry history and folk uses. One of the earliest accounts of human consumption of blackberries in Europe comes from the stomach remains of the famous Harold Scare woman whose body was preserved within a bog in Denmark and dates back to the pre-Roman Iron Age. Blackberries also grow wild throughout many other European locations, where they have a long history and use as an edible fruit. Harvesting wild blackberries as well as other rubus species is often referred to as brambling in the British Isles, especially parts of England where it is a traditional, popular pastime activity. The wild foraged berries are well known for their use in the age-old practice of making blackberry wine, vinegar, and cordials. English botanist John Gerard lists species of the genus Rubus, or the bramble bush, in his famous book, The Herbal or General History of Plants. He and other herbalists considered the fruit a valuable astringent and claimed it stopped the looseness of the bowels and soreness in mouth and throat. Like other wild edible berry species, such as the related thimbleberry, Rubus parviflorus, blackberries were commonly utilized by indigenous peoples. Some sources claim that they were typically consumed fresh, but sometimes dried for later use or prepared as a blackberry tea. According to the book Tending the Wild, Native Americans like the Yakuts of Central California would skillfully use hooked branches to move aside the thorny vines to gain access to a greater abundance of berries. Some reports specify the gathering of 50 pounds in one day. Blackberry leaves and roots, high in astringent tannins, have likewise been valued in herbal preparations for bowel issues like diarrhea and dysentery. Wild blackberry roots were also boiled by indigenous peoples like the Quahila to make a tea which was consumed for mild cases of diarrhea. In this video, we will discuss the top health benefits of blackberries and why you might want to occasionally include them in your diet, especially when in season. Top Nutritional Health Benefits of Blackberries Blackberry Antioxidants and Source of Anthocyanins Blackberries are known sources of antioxidants, such as zeaxanthin, lutein, 
tannins, quercetin, and camphorol, as well as phenolic acids including salicylic acid, gallic acid, and elagic acid. Berries like the blackberry are also a top food source of catechins, also found in matcha and cacao. However, one of the major compounds present in dark purple colored blackberries is their anthocyanin content. These are water-soluble, red-purple plant pigments that can act as both antioxidants and anti-inflammatory agents. In 2019 reports, the cyanidin 3 o glucoside compound, also called chrysanthemum, is the major type of anthocyanin found in the fruit of the blackberry species. Cyanidin 3 o glucoside is estimated in some research to make up approximately 80% of berry extracts along with cyanidin-3 rutinoside and minor percentages of other cyanidins. Chrysanthemum, cyanidin 3 o glucoside is also present in other fruits and superfruit varieties like acai, elderberry, black raspberry, black currant, bilberry, and purple grapes. Nutritional quality and the quantity of anthocyanin can vary depending on maturity and ripeness of the fruit. It is our opinion that freshly harvested berries can possibly contain higher amounts of these nutrients. According to earlier research published in the Journal of Agriculture and Food Chemistry, of the many cultivars tested, the Marion variety which is predominantly derived from the wild Rubus ursinus species had the highest total anthocyanin content or ACY. Potential Antioxidant and Anti-Inflammatory Effects Blackberries, as an anthocyanin and polyphenol-rich food, can help to provide a protective antioxidative and anti-inflammatory influence. In some studies, these components have been shown to offer neuroprotective support. In one study, wild blackberry species were found to be more effective in such instances than a commercial variety. In other research, the elagitanins in rubus berries were identified to be helpful in reducing the risk of gastric inflammation. In folk remedies, blackberries were often called gout berries, as they were considered useful for reducing uric acid levels helpful for conditions like gout, a form of inflammatory arthritis causing swelling of joints, especially at the base of the big toe. Consumption of blackberry antioxidants like the carotenoids, lutein, and zeaxanthin, as well as anthocyanin, are nutrients associated with reducing the risk of eye-related diseases such as macular degeneration. Of course, we advise consuming blackberries in tandem with health-promoting diet and lifestyle practices as a preventative approach to chronic health issues. Vitamin C and other nutritional components. Wild blackberries, as well as cultivated varieties, are a source of some vitamins and minerals. A two ounce bowl of raw blackberries, around eight berries, a typical serving size, can supply high amounts of vitamin K and manganese, as well as trace amounts of other nutrients. They are, however, particularly known for their high vitamin C content, and could be a tasty fruit selection to add to the diet to increase daily uptake. A two ounce serving of blackberries offers about 11.8 milligrams of vitamin C, or 20% of the daily value, based on a 2000 calorie diet. Vitamin C is an essential nutritional supplement for maintaining healthy skin and is a vital cofactor necessary for the formation and structure of collagen. It is also a key nutritional component for proper immune functions, tissue repair, neurotransmission, iron absorption, and maintaining the health of cartilage, teeth, and bones. All Rubus blackberry species additionally contain pectin and are good sources of dietary fiber for providing bowel regularity. Unlike raspberries, which have a hollow core, blackberries have a fibrous inner stem, adding to its total soluble and insoluble fiber content. Upon closer inspection, the fruit also has dried remnants, or tiny hairs, called styles, which are of course edible, and if anything, help to add to its fibrous nature. Blackberries tend to have larger seeds, which are hard to thoroughly chew and nutritionally absorb. They do help to add bulk, but will usually pass through the stool undigested. Blackberries are high in fruit sugars and should be avoided by those on a low carb or no sugar dietary protocol. Other low sugar vitamin C concentrates you may also wish to supplement with include superfruit powders like acerola, camu camu, amalaki, and kakadu plum. For the average diet, blackberries can often be better choices over refined sweet foods and processed snacks. 
In addition, wild harvested varieties can be a great way to add that wild spectrum of nutrients that you may not find in store-bought produce. How to use. For highest nutritional value, it is best to eat fresh, raw, ripe berries. Frozen varieties are a second alternative, as well as concentrated dried or freeze-dried juice powders for greater convenience. Blackberries can be consumed alone as the first meal of the day for best digestibility, or can be served atop foods like yogurt, used in dessert recipes, or blended into fruit-based drinks or smoothies. They are traditionally used to make conserves like jam and jelly, but heat processing will again reduce nutrient content. Store-bought berries, as well as freshly harvested berries, will last longer when refrigerated. It's a good idea to keep an eye out for mold growth if you store them for more than two days. We always recommend purchasing organic selections over commercially produced varieties. For more on how to harvest your own wild blackberries, visit the link above or in the description box of this video. Precautions. For the highest health benefits, consume in moderation as excessive amounts may cause acidic conditions. For those with sensitivities to oxalates and or allergies to berries, salicylates, or molds that may contaminate them, it is best to avoid intake. Consult your nutritionist or healthcare provider before adding blackberries to the diet if you have diverticulitis, are pregnant, nursing, taking prescribed medications, or have a serious health condition. Thanks for watching! For top quality Blackberry products, as well as tons of additional info, be sure and check out the links in the description box below this video. Please support us by giving this video a thumbs up and or sharing it if you found it useful. And be sure and check out these other informational videos.